What up, YouTube? Just when you thought it couldn't even get any worse for the WWE. Apparently, Rob Van Dam has decided to come back and join this crappy company called World Wrestling Entertainment. Hmm. Well, uh, well RVD haven't been on WWE since, what has it been? 2000 and was it 2007? I think it was 2007. Um, when Randy Orton basically took RVD out of the game, well, he did go to the Royal Rumble 2009 and he left again. And he had a brief run in TNA, which they done nothing with. Well, uh, I first saw RVD burst on the scene in WWF around the uh, invasion time. I wasn't really watching ECW, so I didn't really know too much about Rob Van Dam, but I got to know Rob Van Dam in his time in WWE. And Rob Van Dam is one of the greatest hardcore superstars of all time. And to have RVD on your show, you got to at least have a hardcore fan base you know that's what the WWE was kind of like when RVD left they was kind of still in the era of goodness but there's no hardcore era in the WWE um we got all pieces of trash in the WWE and that gets me to thinking like what is RVD coming back to this for you know I'm, I'm kind of feel bad for him because he's not coming back to the WWE like he was when he was with the Alliance. He's coming back to a pretty piece of trashy, John Cena, watered down piece of shit of WWE. And I liked it to do RVD when he fought John Cena at One Night Stand. And the matches he had with Jeff Hardy and Kane and Stone Cold and The Rock and Undertaker and William Regal and Edge and, and the list goes on. Intercontinental Championships. WWE championships I feel bad for RVD like really because I'm no WWE fan and I don't want RVD back in the WWE <laughs> a lot of fans are getting excited about this but realistically look what happened to The Rock they disrespected the man and he the one that put asses in seats and it wouldn't be no John Cena if it wasn't for The Rock and look what they did to him. They made him a Muppet Baby. There's no good feud for him but CM Punk. And we don't want to see him fight that asshole John Cena. Because they know realistically John Cena going to beat RVD. Because John Cena is a poster boy. He Vince McMahon boyfriend. If John Cena go with Vince McMahon. You know. And RVD is that kind of cat. That need hardcore style wrestling. Because what's RVD without the hardcore fan base? You know, when WWF was in the Attitude Era, it was still based around hardcore wrestling. This shit we see today is not hardcore wrestling. You got a 13-year-old girl named AJ Lee running around manipulating somebody named Caitlyn. And bad acting from, from Caitlyn craziness she crying because she lost the divas championship which is a toy when did you ever see Lita crying because she lost the title it's just crazy RVD is not going to fit into this you know he's not going to fit into the WWE we're going to make him fight a son of a bitch named Damian Sandow who comes to the ring in hallelujah music Seamus, his white pale self. You know, the WWE don't got no playing blends playing good stars anymore. And if you to subject R V D R V D must need some money. Because I don't see why the hell would Mr. Monday night wanna come back to this piece of shit. It, you know, he was good when he was tag teaming with Rey Mysterio. RVD gonna be RVD regardless. But we don't want to see RVD be 
subjected to the PGA. I don't want to see RVD suffer like I'm seeing a lot of these superstars suffer. You see, they gonna give him the world championship run when he come back, or is he gonna fight for the world heavyweight title? Or what's gonna happen with Rob Van Dam when he come back? It's a lot of questions to be answered. If you knew what was best for you, RVD, you wouldn't come back to this. I can see it now. RVD talking to Muppet Babies. Yeah, dude, I'm Rob Van Dam, Kermit the Frog. Yeah, RVD, Miss Piggy. You know, I'm the whole effing show, Fozzie Bear. That's WWE model. And then they're just going to throw him to John Cena. They're just going to throw him to that jackass John Cena. Because you know John Cena a piece of shit anyway. You know, he a piece of garbage. This is why can't nobody stand John Cena. I wish RVD the best of luck. I wish him the best of luck. Cause he, the way WWE go in these days, you know, he'll be somewhere in the ring with Hornswoggle. This WWE just don't fit RVD. He would have been better off coming like coming back around the time when WWE was still good, but. Not while this piece of crap is on top of the mountain, John Cena, 13-time WWE Championship, my ass. RVD, if you knew what was best for you, don't come back to this piece of shit.